here in a new house doing an inspection and I saw the duct work that they put in for the micro hood and I just had to throw this tip out there to anybody who's doing a kitchen remodel and having to move or adjust or change their micro hood or their hood fan or whatever it is they're using to exhaust over their range. And um, what they've done is, is they've went and added a good chunk of duct work in the wall so that when they drywall, they don't have to go back and try to figure out where the duct is. They can just cut right into it and, and they're good to go. So here, I'll show you real fast. Um, hopefully this will help you out if you are doing a kitchen remodel. Okay, so you can see this big chunk of duct they've put in the wall. So once they drywall, this duct is in the wall. And, you know, they probably have a general idea of where their micro hood's going to sit or their hood fan. Um, but as far as tying into it, they can tie into it anywhere. It can be down here, it can be up there. And, and then the, the duct hooks to it and just takes it up out through the roof. They've got their nail plates on there to protect it. The duct itself is all sealed up so that as far as uh, air penetration, it should be all sealed. And they'll drywall, get your cabinets in, you go set your micro hood or your hood fan, and you just cut into that duct, tie into it, and you are good to go. So there is a quick tip on um, hooking up your exhaust fan for your range in your house if you're doing a kitchen remodel. So this has been with Building Code Tips. I hope this tip helps you out and keeps you moving on your project. Um, by all means, hit the subscribe button for more videos and definitely hit like. I appreciate the support if this helps you out. And uh, visit buildingcodetips.com for more tips and guides. Help keep you moving on your project.